Ladies and gentlemen, welcome your faces back to the Myonesian Isles. This is an island where I was supposed to be all by myself. That's right, all by myself because we had a whole isolation of a coronavirus outbreak in the world. So I started on an island by myself. As you can see now, I have a lot of dogs. Got a lot of cats. Got a lot of iron men just cruising around doing their thing. And they also have an annoying neighbor called Captain Sparkles who's finally, can I point out, finally took inspiration from... The god that is known as Iron Eye is one true Minecraft girlfriend. One absolute simp. Uh, he's gone, oh, I, I love you, what you've done. I'm just going to basically copy it. But um, apparently it's Captain Sizzles. Si Sparkles, size doesn't matter because he made his much smaller. Therefore, he's inferior to that person. So what a slug he is. Uh, Carl, on the other hand, uh, my other neighbor who lives over there, uh, he's not doing an awful lot with his house. It he keeps extending it bit by bit, but it's still not really changed. Doesn't look too aesthetically pleasing, but it looks better because I did some improvements on it. Now today, we're diving in as I need to get some shiz done. That's right, these are all the things I need to get done. So I'm going to try and work my way through them. Some I'm, I'm not going to do it in any sort of order. But a viewer recommended doing a doomsday bunker because the whole situation on the island is uh, the darkness has arrived. And it seems that Carl has chosen the path of darkness. So... Everything you see here is probably going to get destroyed, which I'm not too happy about. So it's time to, uh, you know, get the point that get like dispensers going so we can stand in it like Iron Man style and get fully geared up. It gives us swords, potions and everything. And we can just keep going for fighting this. It'd be, it'd be, it'd be, it'd be, it'd be epic and all that sort of stuff. But more importantly today, when everyone gets on, we need to work on the tank of judgment. Uh, yeah, it's supposed to say judgment, comfort it all on. So we need to get working on that. But yeah, I've got a few little things I need to do today. So we're just going to tinker on with doing it. First things first, I think I'm going to take care of the lighthouse villager situation. Because it's kind of a pain in the ass. So, the reason why this needs fixing and sorting is because I just have this weird setup. I have a random golem in here. I've got a villager in here that I'm not exactly doing anything with. We could use this space here as a breeding area for the villagers. Which I think could be like a pretty... Uh, good way of doing things but the problem is we're actually missing someone and because we have a space for that guy upstairs i'm gonna drop him down let him get in here and then we're gonna have a new person because this guy over here being terence gives us a pretty solid trade one coal for an emerald amazing and then this guy over here gives us actually pretty pretty, pretty bad trade uh, oh, oh sorry he gives us a bookshelves a, a whopping bu bookshelf one one emerald equals one bookshelf and then the guy we had here actually bought like but what an emerald for bookshelf so we basically we made a lot of, a lot of emerald cash however he is gone so rest in peace i think his name was cog i, I have a, i have a lot of um people on this island and they all end up dying yeah they, they, they all end up dying you know uh, motivational chicken he died um derek he died and let me just let me take this all down this is from the, the funeral we had betsy macau she died shaggy the sheep he died and then uh leo my cat he died, um, and, you know, just for full clarification, I slaughtered him. Yeah, kind of... Yeah, kind of shot him with a bow right in the face. But, hey, listen, it was an accident, all right? I didn't mean to do it, but I still did it. So, nonetheless, that's that. I'm also feeling pretty bad for these dogs because there's no way I'm going to have enough, like, food to be able to feed them all uh, without them all breeding because I kept feeding them food, and then I got another one, another one, another one, and I was supposed to only have three. Now I've got six bloody dogs on my island, and I'm just like, right... How am I going to remember Ghost, Tyson, Scar, Barkley, Marley, and Dexter? How am I going to remember these guys? I killed my cat twice. Oh, yeah, I killed my cat twice. I got, uh, yeah, it's, uh, I'm really good at being an owner of animals in Minecraft. I got given the opportunity to basically, like, resurrect him from the dead. Uh, like, save him in the afterlife or kill him again. And I killed him again. I'm not really good at being an I'm not. I'm not really good at being an owner. Oh, yeah, there is... Uh, there's, there's also there's also the uh, the other animal. I uh, had a pet fish. Yeah, he's dead. R ring one out for the homies there, but yeah, he's dead. So yeah, kind of kind of balls that one up as well. <laughs> kind of need to learn to stop having pets. Or basically, more than anything, I need to stop naming them. All right, I need to stop naming them. Therefore, I won't get attached, and they won't be my pets. They, ju they can just be a load of strays on the island, and that I'm okay with. So first task. The way I'm going to do this is I'm just going to get stone. And I know it's dead simple, but I'm going to drop this guy, all right, from here. And I'm just going to hope he just runs in. It's as simple as that. I've got the block ready. I'm going to destroy this. I'm going to let him fall down. And if he doesn't fall, well, it's like playing that game you like with the penguins. Where you like, wait for them to drop. You can come down here as well while you're at it. Hang on a minute. I'm going to need to... Oh! Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Before he doesn't run away. Yes! All right. 
Get in. I actually don't want him to be a cleric or whatever it's called. So I'm going to destroy that. All right. Get oh, bloody hell. All right. He's joined us. Hello. Oh, he's so excited. He is so... He is... He is... He is excited as hell to get in. Right. Now, listen. I'm going to need you, you no, know, to go in here. How do I get him into here? You could do the magic of... Um. <clears throat> right. He should be looking for a bed, looking for a bed, looking for a bed. Go on. That's your bed. Go on. You can have it. It's yours. I think he's trying to get to his bed upstairs. He is, isn't he? All right, listen, your bed's gone. Get in your bed. Everyone else is in a bed except you. Get in. The, get in the bed. Oh. What? All right, hang on a minute. Right, we'll disconnect, reconnect. Is he just had me off? Oh. Get in. Stay. There we go. Right, great success. The first task of the day has been completed. Can't even complain. Does anyone know why he's not sleeping? Oh! Uh, uh? <laughs> uh, I'd just like to point out that um, I am proving myself to die and I 100%, but you've always got to like, assess your options. And an option that I've decided to do is keep one of the uh, Shadow Swords that Cal put on the ground. Um, probably shouldn't have it, but I thought... <laughs> What's the worst that could happen, right? What's the, what's, what's, the, what's the worst that could happen? I really should hide this somewhere where the others aren't going to see it. Because if they find that I've got the sword, I'm probably going to get outed as, a, as like a traitor to my god. And though I'm not, I'm going to put it in there and hope they don't anything. Oh, actually, I've completely forgot. I could put another, another Never Star on the, on the island. Doesn't mean I'm going to completely create one, but just, just throwing it out there. All right, let's put this in here. This, this, is, like, this is like my storyline collection chest. You can get rid of those rockets. I hate those. Uh, that's like my rarities chest. I do need an actual room to put like my suits of armor in. Being like that was from that adventure. That was from that adventure. Just like Iron Man does. It would look sick. But I just, I never get around to doing it. And everyone keeps saying to me, so I'll put it in an ender chest so they don't find it. Ender chests, I'm not joking, are cheating on this server. Every time Captain Sparkles has got one, he's a cheat. And he won't get rid of him because he's a cheat. All right, I've told you. He's a cheat. I'd like a vault. That'd be pretty cool. You know, we're not, we're not rushing around. Right. I, listen, my inventory is somewhat organized. Do you know, oh, do you know what we could do? Do you know what? This is a genius idea. Um, We could... If we put this here, and we put on a list of what their best trade is, then we'd know straight away, wouldn't we? So this guy buys coal off us, which we're going to buy. Boom, like that. And then this guy buys bookshelf off us, which we're going to buy as well. So like that. So we know that if we ever need max out or anything, he's our coal guy, he's our bookshelf guy. Oh, he's lost his trade. Yes. All right, what should we turn him into? We've got coal guy, book guy, who... You know, you could have said we wanted him for mending, but we, we don't really care. It really doesn't matter. Uh, oh, wait, he's renewed. Nice. And I'm trying to get this guy's name tag prices down. They're too expensive. You need to work on that, all right? Oh, oh, oh no. Wait, hang on a minute. Oh, everything went up. Damn it, it went up by 12. I mean, by two. Damn it, that wasn't meant. Now he's freaking out. Okay, so what are we saying? A Fletcher? Okay, we'll turn him into a Fletcher. All right, that's that's the plan. Now, we could keep doing the thing where we just trade this guy until he gives us a good deal, but I really don't care. What's your job, lad? Ooh, you sell sticks. Wait. Wait, I have to give you an emerald, 10 gravel, and you'll give me 10 flint. That's a terrible deal. You're a thief. You are a fifth! But I'll do it. <laughs> wait, listen. Oh, wait. We need to give him his name tag. Boris. Hello, Mr. Boris. Wait. No. Wait, have you already gotten it? That explains it. Boris! All right, we got Boris. We got... Wait, what's your name? Wait, what? Terence? He's not got a name. We need a new name. It may go Karen. Karen. Look at that. She's sleeping on the job. Typical Karen. All right. So we've got we've got Terrence, Karen, and Boris. All right. If you get, well, listen, if you guys are sleeping, I'm sleeping, right? I feel, feel left out. I, you, get off there. You look disgusting. Embarrassment to the house. Push. Get out of there. Put it in the bedroom. Everyone, everyone likes a bit of feng shui in the bedroom. What do you mean I can't sleep? Bro, they're sleeping. I'm sleeping. Time to make some business happen. You... About to become the greatest. Shut up, Karen. No one likes you. How do I make Karen like me again? 
Is there a, is there a, is there a way to, to make a like me? I know I need to get this guy infected, but we'll deal with that at a later date. All right. Anything else? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Eh? Actually. I... Weird that you want to buy that. Because, oh, oh, oh. Let me, let me just, uh, let me just point out. You guys thought I was stupid when I collected all this flint. But look who's laughing now, mate. Look, look who's having the last dance. Right, what have you got here, right? Listen, I'm going to sell you these, all right? And they're going to be a booming trade. Booming trade. All right, how many have I got? Oh, I got 26 emeralds. Oh, what have we got? Crossbow? Mate. Morris, I'm not liking your deals, mate. I'm not liking your deals one bit, mate. I don't like your deals. You're supposed to give me a jammy dodger as a deal. You're bloody ripping me off sideways. Why is this? Morris, you're doing me dirty. How about now? Talk to me. What have you got? What the bloody hell is that? Are you... Wait, is he Max? Is this it? Is this all this guy trades me? <gasps> Wait. Feather... <laughs> Hold that thought. Listen. You want to buy feathers? I'm your man for feathers. All right? Listen. I got little feathers, big feathers, small feathers, all the feathers. Give me the trade. Boom. 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 Told you, Boris. I'm the man for the job. All right? I got feathers. You need feathers? I got them. You know what we should do, then? We should put in here... Where's my toolbox? Give me... Give me a little bit more. What we should do... Is this... We make chests, all right? And then we destroy that. We put chests there on each one sort of station area. We can put in the thing that we want to trade in. All right, what I was going to do is now with this gap here, I can't put that in it. What? I can't put that in it. I was going to give you a clock, Karen. Karen, I was going to... Wait, give me... Give me... Sell me two more clocks, Karen. I feel like clocks are expensive to make. All right, Karen. Because I feel like your house is looking a bit, a bit empty. I'm gonna give you a clock. Boom, clock, and you, clock, and you, clock. See? Put it on the chest. Put the clock. Oh, I could have put it there actually. It would have looked a bit nicer. What? What's like the typical? What's like the typical security guy name? Hey, hey, Tony. We can't call him Tony. We've already had a Tony. Iron Man, remember? All right, get rid of you. All right, you need a. Hey, 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 hey. Give me some business. Good deal. Even though you ripped me off. Give me that. Putting this in here. Boom. All right. Uh, 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 we'll move you. So box needs to go. Boom. Thank you. Boom. Yeah, that was made out of your that your friends. Okay. What are we calling him? Big Dave. Dude. Yeah. Obviously. Big Dave. Big Dave. That was an obvious one. If you didn't say Big Dave, I don't understand who you are as a person. He's obviously a Big Dave. Yeah. That's exactly what I was looking for. Like, someone who you could, like, the typical bouncer name. Who's on the door? It's Big Dave. What do you mean? Big Dave. You know Big Dave. Big Dave from down the road. Big Dave who works at Willoughby's. Oh, yeah, I know Big Dave. Yeah, Big Dave. All right. So, you might be like, oh, that's flying. That's cheating. All right, when we're building, we're allowed to use fly. Hashtag fly. There we go. All right, give me, give me a bit of this. Wait. Okay. All right, put me down, put me down. A bit of that. All right. Now, the reason why I'm doing this is to keep whoever it was in the comments happy. Look, you ready? There you go. The vines will grow. It'll match. It'll look good. Ta da Okay. Are we happy with this now? I feel like we should have a different colored floor rather than stone. Even though it's a foundation, should we put stone stone bricks down? Or should we try something different? Should we try a bit of feng shui? Should we try a little bit of, like, diorite, maybe? Like, polished diorite? Does that make it, like, a bit of a, like, a, a shopping district area? Oh, we have it. What have we got? Just hear me out. Red terracotta? Yeah, make it different. I, I agree. Now, I, I'm only using this ju just for the sake of seeing what it looks like, all right? I, I don't know if it's going to be nice or not. It might look absolutely trash. We might not like it. But I just thought, you know, we'll give it we'll give it go. See, see what we think of it. Get, you know, give it like, it's like a clean marketplace. You know what I'm bloody saying? Listen, Big Dave, if you climb in this bloody hole whilst I'm filling out, we'll be absolutely fuming at you. No, it's, it's, it's not that bad, is it? It, it, it's not, it, you know what, it's not the end of the world. It's not the end, right, Dave, don't go down there. Right, come here, you, before you go buggering off. Right, 
you know what? That's actually not a bad look for in here. Is it? It's actually... It's like a clean look to it. I like it. We, we were actually going to make it like a tavern style. But we've kind of... Shut up, Big Dave. Right? I don't care if you don't like it. I think... I think this, this looks cracking. That... Is it fully, like, sort of changed to have, like, more light and colour into it? And look how different it looks. Like, if I put it in subscriber only mode and see what the chat thinks. Chat, do you like it? Yes or no? With your panels. I much prefer it before it, I will say. But it's definitely a different look. It's like a, just a completely different style. You know what I mean? It's a complete different style. Which I really don't mind. Now, the reason why I'm just dropping these down is even though it does add to, like, the underneath effect, it, it's a completely different look. Chicken, I just don't, I just don't mind it. It's not too offensive. This this carpet breaks it up. You can do like that and break up the room a bit. Well, I don't think you need that. It really breaks up to something different. But when you think about it, does it really fit with the pirate theme that I've been going for on the island? Like, you know, you've got, like, the pirate-looking watchtower. You've got the pirate, like, everything. And then you come in here and it's like... It's not really... not. It's not really piratey, is it? It's not. So, unfortunately, we're gonna, it's got to go. I, I knew it would be a risky decision trying to make something out of polished diorite. And we were just wrong. We should have stuck with what we've done for the entire island, which is the pirate theme, which is andesite and wood. And we've, we've made this look so much better. The andesite and wood combination is definitely the play. 100% definitely the play. It's so much better off. And it looks like it's got so much more depth to it. It also looks like there's just so much going on here with all this. I might start putting like some slabs in there with plant pots on it and stuff like that. But that looks so much better. And I like Big Dave, all right? I'm sure he's got a job to do and I'm sure he's got a family. But bro, I might have to kill him. I'm not kidding you. He's doing me tits in. He just, he just, he just keeps doing me head in. I, he's just doing me head in. I can't exp I just can't express it. He's doing me heading. Just walking around the gaff, smashing shit up, and pushing me out of the way all the time. And listen, I know it's because you're trapped, but that's not my fault. That's yours. So, uh, villager trading area, I think is safe to say we've done a good improvement. Can I do that? Oh, that looks better. Oh! Wow! <gasps> oh my gosh. Right, well, we are going to have to put him down now, aren't we? Oh my gosh, mate. I made it out of there with half a heart. Bloody hell. Big, uh, uh, hey, I'm sorry. Big Dave, you were so big. Well, you're an enemy of the state now. Hey, you can't, you can't come into my shopping precinct to try and kill me. You know what I'm saying? Just can't do it. Uh, I'm fine. I'll plant, your, I'll plant your flower in loving memory. Forever will these roses sit here to remember Dave. Dave, I'm so sorry. You were so big. You were so big, Dave. Hey, boys. Wow. What's going on? I have never All right, seen these animations so... before. What animations? The minor animations. Oh, it's oh, bro, they're so good. Hilarious. Actually, I, I, god tier. I'm, I'm gonna be back in 40 seconds. Let me just watch the end of this. I just wanted to touch on this is hilarious. Actually, brilliant. <laughs> All right, um, Jordan, what's the plan? Yeah. Okay. So here was my thought. We okay. kind of upgrade. We kind of upgrade it from season one, right? So yeah, 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 yeah. we're gonna have a, a large, like, obsidian sort of uh, uh, platform in here. And then I was thinking out of like the corners. I don't know. How many we do? Six of them, eight of them, what have you? Kind of like obsidian tentacly. I'm making hand gestures, so this is definitely going to help you out. My hand gestures. Yep. Uh, yeah, <laughs> like tentacly obsidian pillars coming out of the the edges of the platform and kind of converging towards the glass chamber in the center. So let me give you a miniature diagram out of dirt, and you will totally, totally get the idea. My little recording of your entire example of what you did totally didn't get cut off because I ran out of memory space on my OBS. But, oh, mate, yeah. Uh, mate, Captain Sparkles. How did, how did you run out of memory on your computer? Two terabytes of memory for recording. And I, I, I all of a sudden, as you were explaining it, all I heard was, I was like, uh, <laughs> uh, that didn't record any of it. You uh, clear some stuff up right yeah, there. I just deleted a terabyte and a half of footage. I probably deleted something I probably needed. Okay. Charity stream, <laughs> but I just deleted it because I was, listen, the viewers come first. All right, so we need obsidian then, yep. Yeah? Uh, oh, I've got it. Wait, where are you going? Um, nowhere. He was gonna go get obsidian. I was not going to get obsidian. <laughs> oh, yeah, dude, I, I, I come prepared. Man. Oh, 
Okay. Nothing in there, but I'll just. Wait, 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 one sec, Cal. He seems to have got the job done. So do we just like walk around? That's why I just walked off. Are we just? Yeah, that's are we, I mean. oh, yeah. just Don't worry, Jordan. We'll help. Right, let's just hit, hit. Let's just hit plants. Yeah, yeah. Look at us. Hard work. Hey, Cal. Cal, get your hat on. Oh, where's my hat? Cal. Cal. Oh yeah. Working hard or hardly working? Got, where's your toolbox? Put your toolbox down. Look, there's Jordan's. It is. All right. Wow, we all got different colors. <laughs> wow. We're uh, so cool. I mean, uh, if you guys really just want to go get obsidian, you can just go to the end and mine a bunch and then I'll just build it. It's up to you, really. Okay, yeah, yeah. That sounds like a deal. Yeah, yeah. okay. We'll go get, obs we'll go get obsidian. Yeah, you're I, I, oh, man, they're definitely going to the end. This is great. Aren't they helpful, everyone? Oh, Aren't yeah. So all right. Carl, follow me. We'll go get all the materials that we totally need. All right, Carl, our mission, which we have chosen to accept, is Jordan, you've nicked off this bloody pillar. Yeah, that was the idea. Go get others or continue it. Crumple stilt skins. You're a bit hey, of a bullet. This is your ender farm. What, below, behind you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I know. That. Yeah, well, yeah, I know. You would know if you've been using it. Your farm. I don't know. I've only used it once and you were there. Yeah. Well done. What do you need? Obsidian. All right. I'm going to get enough obsidian for me to be able to do some decorating and, and building. And we'll be we'll be, we'll be be sorted. Hey, Carl. Working hard or hardly working there, fella? I'm hardly working, bro. Oh. Well, that was <laughs> not the answer I was looking for. All right. Working hard, hardly working. Right, boys. I got 64 of 64. I'm coming, I'm coming doing my feng shui additions to the island. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! How did you mine it that quick? Efficiency 5 pickaxe, bro. What pickaxe you got? Four. Uh, efficiency 4. Oh, oh, that's what you... Oh, you need that 5, dude. Man, You're you need that now. 5. Oh, dude. Man, you, oh. you slow. Wait. Well, no, I have got efficiency 5. The V is a 5, innit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh Jordan! Like ain't a feng shui. Yeah, pretty feng shui, isn't it? Okay, so is this... Yeah, okay. Uh, oh, right, yeah, we can... Oh, lava moat seems cool. Oh, that that could be cool, dude. What? Or a quartz board. Mm, quartz border could also Ooh. look nice. Yeah, I think quartz would... Uh... Yeah, quartz would be pretty slick. All right, I'll, I, I'll do that. I, I'd like to say I had loads of quartz, but... <sighs> yeah. Gave them all to it for the... In my temple. Wh what? Why are you yeah. accusing me? Oh, I came clean with that, didn't I? You came clean, bro. <laughs> what are you talking about? Damn it. What about an end stone outside? Uh, I feel like... Uh... Yeah, I feel like quartz looks nicer. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I want to do, like, some kind of variation on each each technically looking thing, Pardon? but that's the basic concept, yeah. Well, the thing is, you've got the vision for it, bro, so I'm de I definitely don't want to mess with this. I want. I want to start making the outsides of it and everything looking good. I feel like. I feel like uh, on like the the sixty minute makeovers or whatever. You're the person who goes in with like the jackhammer ripping the place off, and then I'm the person who comes in like, oh my god, we should have some pink flowers over here, some chandeliers over here. And I don't know why I'm speaking like that, but were you were you big on interior decorating, big building your house? In real life. Yes. My house is nowhere near interior decorated. <laughs> bro, all my walls are white. It's still being decorated. <laughs> yeah, now. bro, my, still to this day, it's it's still being worked on. Like, I, I'd love to do it. Like, when I've got everything at my disposal, like, say, like, Minecraft, like, put this here, put that there. I'm great at doing it. But, like, you know, I think when you try to actually decorate your house, bro, it, it takes ages. Going Can to I the same age? place. I mean, I'm still going on, on mine. It's It's been... Four yeah, and a half years. It kind of never stops. I've been on a kick though on during quarantine, dude. Oh, yeah? I've been going ham on the interior decoration. Yeah, yeah, your gym doesn't count. All no, you've, no, done, all done, you've done, done is your other, gym. I've done other stuff, dude. I've been doing a lot of home projects. Oh yeah? Yeah. Yo, why don't you why are you doing why are you doing uh, a vlog? Day in the life of Jordan. Do some decorating. I'd watch. I'd watch that. Would you? Yeah, oh, bro. You, dude. I'd love to see the a day in the life of uh, Jordan decorating his house. Anyone can watch you sit in your car for three hours. I want to see you doing a bit of feng shui. Am I like chief obsidian go-getter then? I, Not my job. I <laughs> think that you've provided us with a decent amount, but I guess we'll see if we end up needing more. more. Oh, shut up, you. By the way, ignore what I'm doing with this, Jordan. I'm just, I'm just trying to make it. I'm just messing around with it. All right. Definitely Let's using way too chill. much on it. 
Oh, now I've just made a staircase. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Oh, wow. Good feng shui right there, Tom. Maybe that's the entrance. Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, you made Whatever. Tell, dude. That's kind of what I was going for, to be fair. I'll give it a tail real quick in some eyes. With netherrack and make sure I have the form. Okay, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> It actually looks like a face. Look, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look I'll, give it is, I'll, I'll give it is, man. I'll give it is. Oh my god, you built out a goddamn tail on it too, bro. <laughs> 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 It looks Leo's like a cat, not a dinosaur. It actually Leo does look back. like a cat. <laughs> Leo is back, man. It's Leo in obsidian form. <laughs> Meow. All right. Oh to well, time to kill it for the third time in a row. God damn. You Jesus. didn't even mean that. No way. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. We're supposed to look like a cat, right? It's supposed to look like an evil Godzilla, but it is what it is. So we're there eating away at this restaurant, and this guy's like at this place, they make this like really famous guacamole or whatever it was. It was a and Caesar salad. That was a Caesar salad. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Same thing. It was green. Caesar yeah. salad. It's actually really good. They do. It, they, it, like, it, they, it's pretty good. They bring all the a cart to your table, and it's 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 va va boom. It's va va boom. Tasty. So the, the guy, the guy's like whipping it up and everything like that, and I'm like, yeah, okay, okay. Um, and then I go, look at this guy, because you know, like the way he's doing it, it's all dead fancy and flicking it around and stuff like this with the sauces. And I'm like, check you out, like you know, not be rude, but I was like, like little Gordon Ramsay over, here. and he was like, no, oh, that's funny. Because uh, he's right behind you. And I was like, yeah, right. Look behind me. God and Ramsey's there for his daughter's like birthday. I'm like, whoa. I was like, what are the chances? I think he said something smirky like, oh, you can find out yourself. He's right behind you. And then I was like, oh, dead embarrassed. And then Don Cheadle, uh, oh War Machine, Iron know. Man's best mate. Uh, yeah, he was behind me the entire time. The person I was with, I was like, I swear I know him off something. But I couldn't put my finger on it because I didn't have my glasses on. So I couldn't tell if it was actually him or not. So, and, and I definitely wasn't going to be that guy just being rude the entire time. Just like staring at him. Like, or making him feel uncomfortable. <laughs> no, like, he was like, like, him. Me. I think he no, no, no. He just caught time. So anyway. Oh, so, you were there this time, Carl? Oh, no, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. No, 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 no. So the, uh, so the waiter came over and, it, and he, he, he knew me from previously being there. I think like with you, Jordan, or some other people. And I was like, oh, I said hello to him. And I was like, I'm not being weird or anything, but am I right in saying that that's I, I, the guy? I said, the guy the, the guy from the Avengers. And he was like, yeah, it's Don Cheadle. I was like, I fucking knew it was Don Cheadle. The person next to me genuinely didn't think it was. So I was like, yeah, John Cheadle. Nice one. Nailed it. And then I was like, you know what? Don Cheadle's an awesome guy. Love to get a photo with him. But he's eating his food. Leave him to it. He's gone to the bathroom. I he's gone to the bathroom. I, no, complete, him. completely left him to it. <laughs> Actually, when I walk, I walked out the bathroom from going to the toilet. He walked in, so he followed me, and that's all I'm saying, right? With, with flex, right? <laughs> oh, really I'm, I'm joking. Did I'm he joking. stop you and go, are you syndicate? No, but you know what I said. So I actually voiced. I actually. So at the end, I was like, I was like, you know what? I, we just finished fit our bill because like we came in at the same time. We wrapped up paying our bill. He wrapped up paying his bill. Um, and he's, he's like, his date at the time just went to the bathroom. So I go like this. And, and by the way, he's right. He's, he's right on the back of me. Right behind me, right next to me. And, and I didn't I didn't want to make it rude, didn't want to be awkward or anything like that. And I just was like, finish my meal. Him. And I, I lean over and I go, I go, hey Don. No, I go, I, I went, hey Don. And he completely didn't hear me. And I was like, oh. And then I was like, I was like, I, in, in a split second decision, I was like, nah, I'm not making this awkward. Yeah, it was like a huge F in the chat. I went, hey Don. <laughs> And he, at the yeah. side like, hey, Dad, Dad. yeah, I was like, hey, Dad. And then, and then he turned over and I was just like, hey, man, just wait to say, real love your stuff. It's absolutely amazing. And I was like, dead weird, dead weird thing. Um, I know you do like all the Marvel films and stuff like that. I actually voiced acted for Loki in the Avengers mobile game, which I did. So we both worked in the Marvel universe. And he was like, oh, shit, no way. He was like, that's awesome. And then I like talked to him a little bit about it. It was really nice. And then he was like, he was like, yeah, give me one second, uh, and we'll get that photo. I was like, oh, nice, one, bro, appreciate it. And then like the like the coolest celebrity interaction. He um as as like I'm just there like talking to like, like person next to me. I'm like just chatting, relaxing. He leans in and goes, so we're gonna do this thing. And I was like, oh, sick. But then the awkward thing was, you know, like in Boa Jordan, when you're in the booths. You have to go all the way around. So he was like, yeah, let's do this. But I had to go yeah. from like the other side of the, oh. of the barrier. Like go yeah. all the way around to, to him. The and, then, the and then I finally, got, I finally got it. And then it was like, yeah, cheers, man. I appreciate you taking the photo. But I gave the photo to the manager. He was like, you know, more than happy to take the photo. 
he took the photo, but then he was messing it up, and then he didn't get the flash working. Oh, and I was God. like, <laughs> <laughs> anyway, the person who you know who I was with took the photo, and lo and behold, problem solved. Don Chino said, it was "Really nice to meet oh, you." And it was, it was nice. I love you, bro. It, I, it <laughs> didn't get it I'm didn't get awkward. I, I refused. Like I know if I would have left it any second longer, or anything on this, or done anything different, it would have been so awkward. Oh. It, it was perfect. It was absolutely fine, but it had every opportunity. To be the cringiest, most awkward thing ever, but it was actually, I, I genuinely did play off all right. Oh, God, my most awkward celebrity encounter. God damn it. This oh, one still pains it? me to this oh. day. Uh, Rob McKelleny from It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. Have you watched that show? What's he um, called? Ron? Rob oh, McKelleny. Rob. Um, it's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. Is a, it's a great show. Um, it's like Danny okay. Vito is yeah, also on. Yeah, it. this guy. Yeah, yeah. Um, and so he was going to be writing the Minecraft movie uh, mm -hmm. at one point, because again, like their plans have changed so many times. Um, so I he direct messaged me on Twitter and he was like, hey, uh, I, I don't know if you've heard I'm writing the Minecraft movie, would like to get some input just because obviously you play the game a lot. And um, I, you know, obviously I'm new to this whole thing. I'm like, oh, that's that's pretty cool. Sure, of course. And so he's like, ah, oh, let's let's meet for some food. And he chooses a place that's called um, Hugo's, and it's uh, so I look up Hugo's, and it shows this place called Hugo's Tacos, um, kind of over in in the valley area. And I'm like, okay, sounds good. I'll meet you there. And like, we'd only communicated via email um, so far, and I didn't want to like. I didn't know if he thought I I'm always hesitant when it's someone who's like an actor well known um, as far as like asking for a phone number. Cause I'm like, I don't know if you don't like to give that out. So I have yeah. your email. That's fine. Um, and so all I have is his email. I go to park, walk to Hugo's tacos. I'm like waiting for him. He's not showing up. And I'm like, uh, don't tell me oh, you stood okay. him up or he stood you up. No, 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 no. So, I'm I'm not seeing him there, and so I sent him an email. I'm like, hey, I'm I'm here, uh, just seeing if you're uh, if you're around or what's your ETA. He's like, oh, I'm I'm here too. I'm like, what? I don't I don't see you. Um, I'm looking around. I email him again. I'm like, uh, I'm not I'm not seeing you. I'm not sure what I'm not sure what's up. Um, I'm here at Hugo's Tacos. He's like, oh no, I met I met Hugo's. I'm like, what do you mean? This is this is Hugo's, right? So we keep going back, like, and it, because it's emails, like, every oh, response, like, a minute back and yeah, forth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and so I'm like, ah, oh, god damn it, what the fuck is happening? So I'm, like, walking around, <laughs> not finding what the hell is I going on. I can imagine your head <laughs> falling clean off during this. <laughs> oh, go on. So I'm just, oh, wait, did I say it? You said a bad word. Oh, did I say a word? I said a bad word. Oh, God. You said so an sorry. <laughs> My chat's going <laughs> off right now. <laughs> Dang it. I demonetized this whole thing. Um, I'm wondering what I'm wondering what's going on. And so he uh, he he finally is like, oh, it, it looks like you went to Hugo's Tacos across the street. I met Hugo's restaurant. Um, if you walk like across diagonally across the street and down a couple buildings, it's over there. I'm, I'm gonna come out and, and wave to you. And meanwhile, like already probably 15 minutes had gone by with us doing this exchange and me like wandering like a headless chicken, wondering where the heck I'm going, <laughs> feeling like an absolute uh... idiot. Um, and so all that basically, like, he, I, I. I should have just asked for a phone number before the lunch meeting, and now yeah. I will always do that in the future. But I just like didn't want to. I didn't want to seem weird, like I'm trying to get somebody's phone number if he's ever uh, had I don't that think encounter you before. That. So, anyway, um, ate into the lunch by like 15 minutes with that whole thing, and then he didn't end up having a great deal of time for our actual meeting part. And I was just like, oh, this is just this is the worst first impression Aww. to give to someone. <laughs> yeah, that's all uh, I could so tell. Yeah, I, I, he must have thought I was just such an idiot that I couldn't even Google search a restaurant. Properly, <laughs> but I, like, I, I swear that was what showed up. I searched Hugo's and then like the general location. And that's, I hadn't been there before. I didn't realize this is like a restaurant. It's like a very, it's a restaurant that is uh, uh, 
patroned by many celebrities because they have a lot of dietary restriction options. So it's like a very easy place to choose because there's always going to be something for people. And um, anyway, so he must have thought, how does he not know Hugo's, dude? It's but Hugo's, bro. It's a, it's a staple. Right, John, 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 John. I am not ripping into you saying that you did a bad job. I just think that it is based off a normal tree, but an obsidian tree. It does give me a flashback from my night season one, but bro, that thing's going to go. Okay. That, that is I'll never. Take my glowstone back. That, that is bad. If you don't appreciate it, I'm going to take it hey, back. Hey, well, Jordan, dude. we love it. Leave it. Leave it, Jordan. We love it. We love it. We love don't it. Don't be my chat. Don't be my chat. My chat, oh, we hate something, and then I start breaking it. No, no, no. We love the thing. Oh, no. yeah, I know, don't right? Everyone's it. like, wrong, disgusting. How could you make such a thing? Five minutes later, but what you were doing great. <laughs> All right, then. Right. So I think that we've agreed that that needs changing. Got it. All right. I'm trying to vine it all up. What do we think right, of the dark I, wood? Sorry, chat. The other, the other people are, are haters. No, oh, we're, not, we're, we're not. We're not being hated. He's just, he just spawning. Right. Now, Jordan. Oh. Um. Get what? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, that looks better. <laughs> oh, and now it's obsidian. Oh, that looks pretty cool. Bigger trees. Oh, okay. So now he's into it all of a sudden just because it's No, this is everywhere. that's no no my idea when you said about building obsidian trees, I said, should we grow all the dark trees around it and then replace all the bits? Out of these materials, like exactly what I was thinking. This is what I was thinking we we're gonna do. Okay, we'll plant another dark oak now. Well, don't oh, return God it. Damn it. Right, what do we? What do we prefer? What do we prefer though? Like this? I Natural? Think was, I think it was cooler. No, no, go back, go back, go back, go back. We need more. We need more trees though. We need more. We need more. We need. We need one. We need one here. Yeah, we need. We need. We need. One or we, two need more. we need like a tree here, and we need like a tree here. Wait, what are, why are there these dark oak saplings are not going to do anything? No, no, I just placed them there so the oh. the, the magic of the area knows that we need two Gosh. there. You I know? think we need to grow them and then they will be converted after the fact. Yeah. Well, I'd love to chop down the original dark oaks, but it made out of obsidian. Well, okay. Wait, why do you need to chop these down? I got any, I got any more saplings. Oh. <laughs> Do you see my predicament? Oh, it's growing. Wow, it, that's magic. Wow, oh, wow, well, look at that tree. Whoa, whoa, look at this. Look at this. Look at these torches that Jordan, they got placed everywhere. Right. Jordan, what we're Actually, saying. I of... think it might be too dense now with, with this one. I don't think we want this one. It's going to like. Should we leave? Oh, leave that as the in. entrance? Yeah, leave it as the entrance. And then this Wait. makes sense because there's not enough room out here. Should we remove this then? This one? What? This one here? Uh, I don't think. Because like, I, if this I is the entrance be... to the island, look, because mm. then, because then you'd see it, wouldn't you? Like, I do get it being like this, but at least then, like, it's like an entrance to view it. It looks, it looks great like this, bro. It looks like a like a dragon egg, which is like completely a, an epic theme, which I totally like it. Okay, all right. But no, I'm just right. no, no, I, I'm not... no, no, chat, chat. I'm saying all right, chat's agreeing that that, that like you should we should make an entrance area. Um, could try mycelium as well. Oh, oh, uh, yeah, it's mycelium now. I have. What are we thinking? Green. You need to do another vote, Jordan. Green grass, purple pepper, or mycelium. Hold on, I I haven't been able to show mycelium on my end yet, so I'd have to do that. Mycelium's not bad. It's like a. It's like it's pretty lighter on the eyes than um the pepper. All right, hold up. Yeah. Oh, God, I needed to And it's obviously got that grass texture yes. to it. I'm flying over to the island. The boat is sunken, and I'm going to walk up in it like it was a brand new time. I've just got here. Wow, look at this. Whoa. Oh, I, think, I think they'll be impressed, bro. Nice one. Okay, this is way too many vines on this one. Who's in control of vines? Oh, on, uh, you you yep. put them down. But me. you can put string under them to cap them. That's a, that's a good call. On my texture pack, I can see it too clearly, though. All right. Oh, my, it looks okay. Um, well, this is, this, is, this is a fine line between a bit too much van and a lot, little van. A lot of van. You know what I mean? You want a little bit of van, a lot of van. That sort of shit. 
Okay, so out of the list of things today that we've did, uh, that we've did, uh, we did the villager lighthouse section, which I'm happy about. I did want to do some like more work to that, but we've actually done enough. Um, we didn't do the redstone farm, the doomsday deep bunker, an abandoned temple, uh, sort the house out, didn't do that. Oh, oh, furnace, didn't do that. Uh, basement to the nether, didn't do that. And the tank of judgment, we didn't do that. Do you know what? I'm going to do this right now, real quick. One sec. I know you've loved it, but I actually can't stand the sight of it. Ever since it got desecrated, all right? And this is a sign to the others. That I am now a follower of Iron Eye. I'm removing the head of Dianite. I know you may be like, shock, horror, how could he do such a thing? But listen, if we need to prove to the others that I'm Ionite, all right, then this needs to go. I'm a new man. I'm a changed man, okay? It's as simple as that. I'm not the, I'm not the same Tom I used to be. I am, but I'm not to them. So there you go. Dianite's face has been removed. His old temple and everything like that destroyed. Can I make it so... Wait. When you go through the mouth of the skeleton... To here, if we move this, could we technically make... What the hell? If we hollow this out some more, like tomorrow, hollow this out and make this lead through to inside the stairs. And again, yeah, I'm just flying at this point. But the reason for that then is we can have like this archway here underneath meet up. So I'm going to remove this because at first I thought it was a good idea, but it's just it's pointless because it's just too much iron looks too much. But if we have this popping out of here, like we build into the staircase like this, do you reckon I could, I could mine through to it now? Do you reckon we'd reach? Aha! Oh, perfect! Oh! Perfect! Oh my gosh, this might actually end up being at the. This might end up being at the perfect height. So, we have to fill this in better, but. I went higher for that, didn't I? Oh! This is great! So it can flow through into this. I love it. I love it. I love this. It's going to work. So the evil room now can flow down into the house through to the nether pole. Yes! I like this. I like this a lot. I like this a lot. And then this leads into a sick portal room. All right. We got boys. Yes. Look at the chat. Yes. We've got, we got a project on our hands. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a project on our hands. Love it. Love it. We've got a plan. So even though I haven't finished it, obviously, I, I do want to say we now have a sense of direction for the sort out the house and the basement to the nether. So we're going in the right the right direction. But before we do anything, going in any direction, let me quickly fly down here and put another legend on the wall of legends. But with that said, ladies and gentlemen, and the legend put on the... What the hell is going on? I feel like I've been drinking. Where am I? With that said, guys, I do indeed need to wrap up today's episode. I hope you did enjoy it. I, 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 I love the tasks where together we're doing stuff, but I definitely, I, I definitely think we brought... A good aspect to the table, you know, like the dark trees to add that ambience of spookiness. But then my my call of turning in, him into obsidian trees, like he uh, Captain Sparkles was saying, was right. But not a normal tree; it just doesn't look epic enough. Whereas now it looks amazing. We've got working on with that, and hopefully this week we will indeed, like, obviously use that. But these are some things that I want to focus on for the episodes moving forward. I want to get back on track with tasks. And build on the island in full force. Because that, that volcano took us a long ass time. And we needed the beacon for it and all that sort of stuff for it. And I want to start fleshing out the island a lot more. Making it look like uh, a lot of depth to it. Like just really, really step up like our builds on the island. Which we've been doing over the progress of it. And because the storyline stuff is continuing. I don't want to slow that down. So I want to make sure that we're keeping on, on, ta on task with that. But guys, I want to say thank you very much to every single person who's been tuning in. Make sure you leave a like, Crane. Click the subscribe button. Ding down the notification bell. If you don't follow me on Twitch, go and click that follow button. Because we are now less than 13,000 followers from 3 million, which is absolutely crazy. I stream nearly every day except Sundays. Okay. Sundays is my day off. Um, and I stream at 4.30 most days. 
If you tune into my Twitch streams and I'm not streaming Minecraft at 4.30, let me finish whatever I'm doing. Don't go spamming, asking whenever it is. The chance is once the game I'm playing or whatever I'm doing is finished, I'll be continuing on with Minecraft straight after. So guys, I'm going to love you and lead you. Thank you for being respectful in the stream and just being absolutely amazing. And I will catch you guys next time.